There, there are really two types of web developers that are out there on the market today. So one kind understands what technologies to use and how to click the buttons and uh, make magic happen. The other kind of person actually understands that the key to building a really good website is understanding your client. Understanding what your client needs, what the goals of their organization are, and how you can translate the goals of the organization into a really fabulously working website that meets the needs of their end users, meets the needs of the organization, and communicates a strong marketing message. The Vermont Partnership for Fairness and Diversity uh, came to the Grad Center back in the fall and was looking for someone to come and um, basically uh, provide a refresh for their website. Not everybody uses the internet in the same way. And there are other uh, venues on the, on the web that we need to be sure that people know where no, we are represented there. So, so if it's Facebook, if it's YouTube, if it's Flickr, if it's if it's making sure that the executive director is is got contacts on LinkedIn, we need to be sure that we are in all of those places. It's again, it's about that whole community building process um, for an organization that is empowered to build communities. Our website was just really static, cumbersome. Uh, consumer unfriendly place to be. Conceptually, we really like what he's done with it. The sort of bells and whistles, which we never had before, which we never really understood. We control the message that's going out there. And Peter's been uh, really instrumental in making that happen for us. In 2010, it's very important that you're building your websites using a content management system. Uh, and a content management system is a way that you can put information into a database uh, you don't have to know necessarily a whole lot of code or complicated stuff in order to make changes to the, that information. And it means that your client can go ahead and uh, make their own updates for their website. And we went with Joomla because it is um, a full-blown content management system that has infinite levels of customization. And um, at the same time, it has a much lower technical barrier to entry than um, some of the more complicated content management systems such as Drupal. So, Heavier lifting than WordPress, less complicated than Drupal, uh, makes it a really good fit for our students. Uh, my capstone sponsor is Augusta Auctions, and they take consignments from museums and institutions of historic costuming, and clothing, and textiles. And one of the things that they want to do is make this accessible to researchers, plus cut down the turnaround time that it takes them to put new photos up for their new auctions. So what we ended up doing is we're going to uh, the Joomla content management system. One of my major deliverables is to create um, a custom extension for Joomla that will be able to allow them to define their lots, upload from their existing um, access databases that they use to run their business, and actually bring those right up into Joomla. She was a godsend to this uh, project. It, it's so complex, and uh, she took something so hard, made it look simple. It, it's, it's very exciting.